Hi, my name is Annalene and on this channel I make videos about books, fashion, lifestyle and also sometimes Taylor Swift but today we're going to be talking about fashion. I want to show you all of the clothes that I have thrifted in the last few months. I made a video like this a few months ago, I think it was last spring? <laughs> I think like it has been a good few months. It's been nine months. Nine months. And so I want to show you the clothes that I have acquired since then. Let's just get into it. First off, I want to show you this lovely blue gingham top that I got. I got it from Bougie Vintage on Vintage and Instagram. They have a lovely shop and I also got another garment from there. So I will show you that later. I, I love this vibe. It's so cottagecore and it's cute. I like the neckline with the frilly lace and you can also wear it off the shoulder. I usually don't, but if I want to change it up sometimes, then I can. With it, I'm currently wearing my red Dr. Martin shoes. I love them as well. I think they have a very cute pattern and they're really comfy. They go with a lot of my clothes. So that's a, that's a good plus. <laughs> and I also discovered that I can wear this gingham shirt with my gingham skirt. <laughs> At first I thought it would be a little bit too much because it's, you know, gingham on gingham, but because the top has like a smaller gingham pattern than the skirt, I think it actually looks really cute. Next up is an outfit with two thrifted items. Both the skirt and the shirt are thrifted. I got the skirt from Bougie Vintage as well. And the shirt I bought in Bologna in Italy in, I think the thrift store was called Humana Vintage. So if you're ever in Bologna, it was uh, so nice. You should definitely visit. And I love this shirt. It has this cute lace detail. I, I, do, th I do have a little bit of a thing for lace. <laughs> um, it is see-through though, so I like to wear a top underneath and I think it looks really cute with this skirt but I've also worn it in other videos before. I believe I wore it in my Dressing Up Like Taylor Swift album covers video so you can see it in action there too. And with this skirt I tend to wear this dark red sweater. I think it looks really cute. It also looks really good with fights and then it's just like fall vibes. Really, really good. I'm very happy with this purchase. <laughs> Next up I have this jumpsuit, this grey jumpsuit that you might have seen around. I was actually at the thrift store with my friend and she pulled it up and was like this would look so good on you and it does. <laughs> Thank you so much for, for finding that because it, it, this probably wouldn't be an item that I would pick out but once I put it on it looked so good and I loved it <laughs> so I bought it and it was only two euros in the summer I wear it like this but if it is cold then I wear it with tights or thigh high socks and a shirt underneath a white one or a black one and then it looks really good as well and I also like to wear it with this long cardigan this long cardigan is like such a staple in my wardrobe <laughs> I'm so happy with it because you know, for example, when I wear the gingham top and I still get to wear something over top and so people can see my cool items. <laughs> the next item that I got is one that I got from my friend, the same friend who recommended me the jumpsuit. Um, she bought it, it didn't fit her and so she gave it to me. And and I love it. It's again, it is not something that I would pick out myself, but I just I just feel like that friend has such a good view of what looks good on me. <laughs> Cuz I like it a lot. It is really short though. I haven't really found the confidence to wear it just like that with no shirt underneath. So how I've been wearing it is just with this white t-shirt. And another great way that I love to wear this top is showcased in my dressing up like Pokemon trainers video. I love it. I still can't get over how fun the outfit is and how happy it made me. So I'm looking forward to summer and me just going out looking like that because it's just mm, such a good look. I love it. <laughs> A 
And then finally, I think this is actually the item that I've had the longest out of these that I'm showing you today. And it is this beautiful dark green velvety pinafore. It looks really good, but it is a little bit too tight. Um, I did, while filming this video, break it a little bit, like <laughs> the side snapped. Um, so I think what I would like to do is get someone to take out a little bit of a skirt and use that fabric to to add a little bit on top because that would make it easier for me to put it on, take it off, breathe, you know, the essentials. Um, but other than that, I think it looks really good <laughs> and I like it. And I've also shown it before in videos. I like to wear it with just this white t-shirt. I've also worn it with a long sleeved black shirt and just a button up shirt. And, and they all look really good. I think that's it for today. So that's not a lot of items, but I think that is essentially the goal. <laughs> I think if I make one of these videos twice a year, then I'm doing a good job, right? Right? So I think the last one that I filmed, it had items starting in October or November. So this video and the previous one is like one and a half years worth of clothing that I bought. So I think, I think I'm actually doing pretty well on that front. So I try not to buy too many clothes. I mean, my, my closet is completely full. So <laughs> what was your favorite item? Do you think that there might be a different way that I could wear it that would also look good? I would love to know. And if you enjoyed this video, then please give it a thumbs up. I make videos every Wednesday, so I will see you next Wednesday. Bye.